Welcome back to Eyewitness News. Early today, it's a frigid start to your morning. We're going to head on over to meteorologist David Carnes for a look at your forecast. David, what can we expect? Yeah, loving this cold weather in the mornings, uh, looking at a little bit of cold air mixed in with a little bit of fog uh, up on uh, some of the higher elevations around the Cumberland Plateau, west of Chattanooga, going up 24 down into parts of Dade County, northeast Alabama. Might see a little bit of freezing fog in there with it. Uh, meanwhile, uh, looking pretty good, but cold in the valley and up into the Blue Ridge where we're in the low 20s in Murphy. 28 in Chattanooga, 28 in Cleveland, and 29 degrees in Dalton. So another cold morning, but this afternoon actually looks good. 44 by noon, partly cloudy, 53 by 3 p.m. And then even this evening, uh, it will be much more mild than it has been for the past couple of nights. We'll drop down to 49 by 6 p.m., 45 by 9 p.m. Past couple of nights have been in the 30s by 9 p.m. So that will be a welcome warm up for you. A little bit warmer today. It will be breezy this afternoon. We're going to see some rain showers moving in overnight tonight into early Friday morning and then might even see some light snow showers on Saturday morning. So let's break all of that down with our Viper cast imagery. Here's your satellite and radar. Uh, not too much going on now. Here is the front that might bring us a few overnight showers. Viper cast showing uh, some clouds this morning, some areas of fog. We'll see a lot of that lifting late in the day, but still we're going to call it partly cloudy with clouds building back in late tonight as that front approaches. By about 1130 midnight, we're going to start to see a few very spotty showers moving up over the Cumberland Plateau, and then we'll see some of those moving through during the overnight. Much of the area getting, again, very light rain. Uh, this is 3 o'clock in the morning. By the time you're waking up, this is 6 a.m. Still some showers mainly east of Chattanooga, east of the interstate, and then heading on on through the morning, uh, we'll see that clearing out, save one or two spotty showers, maybe Friday afternoon up in the Blue Ridge. Uh, but most of the area after Friday morning is going to be dry and cooler. We'll have highs going from the low 50s uh, today down into the upper 40s tomorrow. And then moving into Saturday, we're looking at some light snow showers drifting through the area uh, during mainly the morning hours. A few of those may linger into the early afternoon, and I don't think we're talking about any uh, crazy amounts of accumulation in the valley. As a matter of fact, you may not get anything more than a few flurries in the valley, but uh, in the mountains you may see a little bit of accumulation. So heading through Saturday, this is Saturday 5 o'clock, and looking at not too much going on, it'll start to clear out. I'm going to put in about a 10% chance for maybe a flurry on Sunday morning, and then most of Sunday is just going to be a cool, dry day for you as you wrap up the weekend. And then look at that moving into Monday morning, uh, maybe one or two flurries and uh, up the Blue Ridge, but again, the chance uh, really not that great. Most of your Monday is going to be high and dry. Looking at some rain showers moving in for late next week. So snowfall amounts. This is what we want to show you uh, for the valley. Again, not too much going on. I'm not going to rule out a few flurries, maybe a light dusting, but uh, most of the accumulation will be in the higher elevations. There we're talking about a quarter to a half an inch, maybe a few isolated spots getting up to an inch. Same going the other way, uh, maybe a quarter of an inch here and there. Higher elevations uh, north of Murphy, you can see where we may get more than an inch of rain, but or snow rather. But yeah, maybe a tenth through a quarter of an inch in LJ Blue Ridge as well. So uh, not a huge snow event on Saturday morning, but we certainly could see some light snow showers moving through. Through. Partly cloudy today. It's going to be mild and breezy this afternoon. Winds out of the south at 10 to 15 miles per hour. We'll get up to 54 in Chattanooga, 52 in Cleveland, 54 in Dalton. So it should feel pretty good for the month of January this afternoon. Uh, increasing clouds tonight. Overnight rain showers. Notice just rain showers. It'll drop down to 40 in Chattanooga. If we see any wintry precipitation, it would have to be up on the plateau. But all the model data that I'm looking at is showing even just rain if we get that uh, any precipitation at all on the plateau. So 32 in um, Altamont will get up to 40, drop down rather to 40 in Chattanooga, 36 Murphy and 38 in Cleveland. Storm alert seven day forecast showing the potential for some rain showers overnight into early Friday morning. That's the 30% and a 40% chance for some snow showers on Saturday morning. 10% chances we head into Sunday morning and then heading into next week. Uh, basically just cold and dry starting out and it will stay chilly but warm up a bit, especially toward the middle and end of next week. We're looking at uh, some pretty decent rain chances moving in as we warm up to 54 on Wednesday, Caroline. All right, David, thank you.